and uh, we've had such a fantastic morning today showing you the wonders of the Mara and uh, I've actually got one more wonder for you before the end of drive it's a bit far now but there is a new bird species circling over the grass and it is a bird that particularly likes grasses and it is oh no it's not what I thought it was and it looks like to be yes it is it's a black-breasted snake eagle and of course this long grass is full of reptiles and that is their favorite food now earlier when as I stopped there was actually also a Montague's Harrier around but I can't see where it's gone but isn't that absolutely gorgeous riding the cool Mara winds in search of schnooks or snakes but uh, it has been absolutely fabulous and uh, I just want to reiterate before we say goodbye today how absolutely f incredible it was to be able to share the, our first black rhino sighting with you and uh, I'm still on an absolute high from that and of course it can only get better and we're going to have better and longer sightings of those absolutely incredible creatures now I'll give actually I've got a challenge for Ali and Taylor before the end of show because um, I know they've both seen black rhinos and probably I've, I've been chased up a tree by quite a few black rhinos in my life so I want Ali and Taylor to uh, give us their best black rhino before it charges mimic and I'm gonna do mine now so basically you want to get on your angry legs like a little uh, like a black rhino and you go <sighs> Now, I can't wait to see Ali and Taylor do that, so let's go back to Juma. Right, I will, I will get you back, don't you worry. Figure out what, maybe I'll make you be a tiny baby giraffe one day. Although I don't think you can be tiny. Right, so a black rhino charging. I'll also make the noise for you, Brent. I think this is probably a safe distance for me to start charging you from. Right, are you ready, Seb? Yep. Because I'm going to come really quickly. Okay. And that is how Ali's black rhino charges. That Coming was, from the bushes and all the way, what do you think, Sam? That was great. Was that it was great? Really Good. Great. <laughs> now, Taylor, you've got to live up to the challenge. Let's see how it all goes. <laughs> My goodness. <laughs> oh, Ali, you know, I'm always up for a good challenge and everybody that's watching knows it, that I don't mind embarrassing myself. However, I physically cannot do a black rhino impersonation at the moment because as you can see, I'm surrounded by Impala and I really don't want to get out of the car and frighten them to death because like we've been saying the whole morning, it's very windy and they're probably on edge as it is. Now imagine if they had to see a wild McCurdy get out the car and start kicking up dust and making all sorts of strange noises. As entertaining as what that would be, Ali, I think that you probably did a very good job and you probably outdid me with the black rhino chart so maybe we will try on the sunset safari then but right now we better be courteous towards these animals and not get out the car and frighten them to death but there's an impala ram herding